Well, let's uh, talk more about Iran now. Our correspondent, Barbara Plett, ushers in Washington. And, and Barbara, we just heard President Obama hailing the implementation of this deal. Do, do you see this? And is it being seen, in fact, as his greatest foreign policy achievement of his years in the White House? Yes, very much, because he's also made it his foreign policy priority, and he's worked very, very hard. He's, he's put all his energy and resources into trying to make this deal work. Um, partly because he had of his interest in non-proliferation, he stated quite early on in his presidency that he wanted to block off possibilities of nuclear non-proliferation, nuclear threats. Also because his policy or his approach has been to say, we will talk to our enemies and that can be productive. We will try to solve problems diplomatically by engaging directly with our enemies. And Iran has been the centerpiece of that policy. So not surprisingly in his speech today, uh, he said this is a victory for smart diplomacy, not only the nuclear deal, but also the American Americans coming home, and that it is worth engaging with with countries like Iran uh, when it comes to our national interests. Uh, he did, of course, underscore that there are still many strains and difficulties in that relationship. Uh, but he, but his his main point, I think, was that this was a victory for diplomacy and for his approach. All right, Barbara, thank you very much indeed for that assessment. Barbara Plettasher there in a rather snowy Washington.